Okay, so this step, I'm going to show you how to install this, the seatbelt tab I provided. We gave you a bolt, and then you're going to reuse some of the old spacers. The NAs have a brick. You're going to use that brick. So, first off, we got to put all this down. This is already split for you. That's how we designed it on the CNC. So it makes it pretty easy. I'm just gonna slide. Sorry, let me get you a better view. I'm gonna slide that in. The seatbelt like that. Now this is where if you go the wrong direction, you could get it wrong. Bring it towards you always. And then slip it around. It gets a little tight here, but it goes and it's in. Up and down. Okay, now, bolt, spacers. I like running this spacer up like this so it sandwiches it all together. Your other spacer and you got just enough thread left. So, Um, this spot right here, you can get a lot of adjustment out of this design. Keep playing around with it. The seatbelts just keep getting better and better. You'll get to a certain point where they're working almost as good as factories. As you can see already without any adjustment. We got it pretty good. Tighten this down. Maybe I always put the seat in, get whoever's driving the car in there, have them play around with it where it works the best for them since they're the ones always driving it and then lock that completely down you never have to touch it again passenger side just yeah and throw it everyone's different hope that helped you guys out um we're almost done with the roll bar install here just put the carpet in trim around we use an exacto blade it's going to be really dark inside of here so i don't think i'm going to get a video of that um other than that this thing's all done just got to put the seat and trim the carpet. We'll get some uh, photos of it pulled out in the daylight showing how good this roll bar looks later.